okay thank you for remembering okay so okay. envelope of the family of uh, okay envelope of the family am square plus bm plus capital c equal to 0 that M is a parameter M is a parameter and and capital A capital B capital C or Are functions of are functions of x and y. Okay. So given. So what is given here? A m square plus b m plus c equal to zero. This is equation one. Here M is a parameter. Okay, now differentiate equation one. differentiate equation 1 partially partially with respect to m we get uh, to differentiate with respect to m you get 2a m plus b equal to 0 this is equation number Okay, now from this equation, I uh, will get m. Okay, first we will get 2am equal to minus b. m equal to minus b by 2a. Now substitute, uh, put sub, uh, substitute m equal to minus b by 2a. To A in the equation number one. In the equation one, we get we get uh, we substitute m equal to minus b by two a. So a into uh, b square by four a square. Plus b into what is m m is minus b by 2a plus c equal to 0 okay now uh, so we can cancel only a so b square by 4a b square by 4a minus b square by b square by 2a plus c equal to 0 this is one fourth this is half so you'll get a minus 1 by 4 b square by a minus b square by 
4 a plus c equal to 0. Uh, this implies c equal to b square by 4 a or or b square equal to 4 a c b square equal to 4 a c or b square minus 4 a c equal to 0. So this is an envelope of equation 1 is the envelope of equation 1. Okay, now just I will recall this one. So, because uh, the recording, this is not uh, uh, done in the recording. So, okay, procedure to find the envelope of a given family. So, this is a general procedure. Uh, consider the family f of x, y, c equal to 0. So, c is the parameter. So, the uh, one parameter family. And if you differentiate equation 1 partially with respect to c, we will get a dou f by dou c is equal to 0. So f is a function of x, y and the parameter c. Uh, if you eliminate c between uh, equation 1 and 2, uh, we get an envelope of equation 1. So this is the general procedure. Suppose your equation is quadratic and quadratic with respect to the parameter then the envelope of the family of curve is b square minus 4ac equal to 0. Okay, now I am going to give the problem. Okay, I think you have full energy. So now, okay, if you solve the problem, if you tell the answer, I also get the energy from you. Okay, so find the envelope of the family of curves. First problem. So usually for taking, I am take a little bit interested for taking first year than second year. You know why? The reason is that. Uh, so first year students are more interactive than second year students. So that is the first reason. Even if you go second year, you will behave same thing. So there is no change. Okay. So that is a trend. So usually first year students are more interactive. Uh, they will ask questions. They will ask doubts. Okay. Uh, even if I ask anything, they will immediately respond. Okay. So that's why I like first year students than second year. So in the second year class, if I take one hour class, sometimes no one spoke to me. So just uh, the one hour I will speak in the class. Some, sometimes one or two students will interact. So, so it's a little bit, uh, you know, okay. Uh, it's a little bit boring. Okay, so so that's why I prefer usually first year class. Okay, so now write the problem. Find the envelope of the families of curves. Find the envelope of the Find the envelope of the family of cows uh, y equal to mx plus a by m, mx plus a by m, where m is a parameter.
So find the envelope of the family of crops, y equal to uh, mx plus a by m, where m is the parameter. Now I am going to solve this problem in two different methods. So method one. I will tell the method two, okay? So you can try method two also independently. Method two is you should convert into quadratic enum. You should try to convert into quadratic enum and find the envelope. So that is the idea. For first method, I am going to use the general procedure. So the general procedure means first I am going to write the equation O equal to mx. plus a by m, this is equation one. So differentiate equation one, partially with respect to m. If you differentiate equation one partially with respect to m, we'll get a zero here. Here with respect to m means we'll get x. And uh, if you differentiate, you can have 1 by m, so minus a by m square. So from this, we have x is equal to a by m square. So x is equal to a by m square. This implies m square equal to m square equal to a by x or m equal to m equal to plus or minus root a by x. So this is the m value. So once you got the value of m, substitute the value of m in equation 1 here and here. So what is y? y equal to mx plus a by m. So y equal to, what is m? m equal to plus or minus root ax into x plus a by m. m is again plus or minus root a by x. So if you simplify this, you'll get y equal to plus or minus uh, root, if here you have root x, you have x, so root a x. So this is also plus, plus or minus, so plus or minus. Here you have a, here you have root a, so root a. And here you have x, so root, here you have root x, so if you simplify, you'll get root a x so y equal to plus or minus 2 root a x or y square equal to 4 a x so this is an envelope of this is an envelope of equation one So, okay. So, anybody, anybody got the answer for method two? Yes, sir. Got the same uh, method two also. Sir. Okay. Okay. Very good. Uh, so, I think you got the same answer. Yes, sir. Okay. What is the quadratic in M equation? X m squared minus y m plus a equals to zero. Okay. X m square minus uh, y m plus a equal to zero. That's correct. Now, so I will do method two. So the given equation is y equal to a max plus a by m. So now if you take LCM or throughout multiply by m, you'll get my equal to m square x plus a 
So we have the equation, quadratic equation, m square x or m, x m square, x m square minus uh, ym plus a equal to 0. And this is an, a quadratic, which is quadratic equation in m. which is quadratic equation in the parameter m. So I write the equation again, xm square minus om plus a equal to 0. OK, here capital A is uh, x and capital B is minus y capital c is a okay so envelope is b square minus 4ac equal to 0 b square minus 4ac is equal to 0 and hence b square equal to y square minus 4 a is x, c is a, so y square equal to y square minus 4x a equal to 0 or y square equal to 4x. Okay. The second problem find the envelope, find the envelope of the family of straight line. straight lines uh, y equal to mx plus or minus root of a square m square uh, minus b square where m is the parameter. So now, uh, just rewrite this equation, okay, y minus uh, mx is equal to um, plus r minus root of, so I don't want to differentiate this now because here have a root, okay, so that's why I tried to convert into quadratic in m. Sometimes it is possible, sometimes it is not possible. If it is possible, you can try. Otherwise, you should differentiate and you should eliminate here. Now, uh, I'm going to square on both sides because I want to remove this root. So by practice only, you know that, how to do, okay? So you sh should solve at least five to 10 problems in the envelope. Then only you'll get some idea. So now uh, this is a minus b whole square formula. It's okay. So y square minus uh, 2m xy plus m square x square equal to, uh, or you can write minus a square m square plus b square equal to 0. OK, now, so first you should write uh, m square and then m and then constant term. So what is m square term? 
here you have m square. So if you take m square commonly, you have x square minus a square into m square, and then this term minus m m term two x y into m, and then y square plus b square. Okay, so plus y square plus b square equal to zero. Okay, now so this is a quadratic in m. You should write uh, easier. Here I don't have enough space. Just I'll write. But in your notebook, you should write is a quadratic in m. So now I will just rewrite this equation in the next page. Uh, x square minus a square into m square minus 2xy into m plus uh, y square plus b square equal to 0. Okay, happy Ugadi. And uh, advance happy Tamil New Year to everyone. Thank you, sir. 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 Yes. Santo Thank you, sir. Santo Santosha. Is it correct? Just I am asking. Man. Okay, uh, so I am expecting tomorrow is a holiday. Okay, so still I am not checking my mail. Okay, usually for uh, Tamil New Year, so we have holiday, but uh, for Telugu New Year, we don't have a holiday here. Okay, so but uh, usually for Telugu New Year, so many Andhra Pradesh students. Uh, uh, they will go to the temple, you know the temple inside the temple, uh, okay, Ganesha temple. They will go to the temple and then they will celebrate Yugadi uh, there, okay. But this year I can't see that function, so due to Corona, okay, hope, so everything will finish, okay, we, you will come back before uh, before the end of this semester, I'm expecting to see everyone. Okay. So we'll so try to solve this problem. X square minus A square. So this is a quadratic in M. But uh, uh, envelope is what? What is the equation of the envelope? The envelope is... Uh, b square minus 4ac equal to 0. So what is b? Here b is what? b is minus 2xy minus 2xy whole square minus 4 into a is x square minus a square And the C is what? B square plus Y square. Yeah, B square plus Y square equal to 0. Now, if you simplify, you'll get 4X square Y square minus 4 into, if you multiply these two, you'll get X square Y square plus X square B square minus A square B square. Sorry, a square uh, y square minus a square b square is equal to 0. So you can cancel 4 and 4. And the x square y square minus x square y square gets cancelled. Okay. And then throw out multiply by minus sign. 
if you multiply throughout by minus sign, you'll get uh, you'll get x square b square minus a square y square minus a square b square equal to zero. So first I am dividing, sorry, uh, throughout divide by four. First, after dividing, you can cancel x square y square minus x square y square. After that, I'm going to throw out multiply by minus one. So x square b square minus a square one. Okay, I got this. Now throw out to divide by a square b square. So we have x square by a square minus y square by b square minus one equal to zero or equal to one. So this is an equation of hyperbola. is the envelope of envelope of equation number one. So that is a given problem. Okay. Now third problem find the envelope of the family of curves x into cos theta by a plus y into sin theta divided by b equal to 1 where theta is a parameter. Where theta is a parameter. Okay, so now here you can't convert this equation into uh, a quadratic in theta. So that's why it is better to differentiate the equation. You take this is one, differentiate, differentiate equation one partially with respect to theta. So you get x by a to, to differentiate cos theta, you'll get minus sine theta plus y by b. And to, to differentiate sine theta, you'll get cos theta is equal to 0. So I call this is equation number 2. Now, we need to eliminate theta from 1 and 2. So, uh, if you know any idea, okay, you can tell how to eliminate uh, theta from 1 and 2. Divide throughout by cos theta. Okay. Uh, I, I, I can't hear you properly. So, from the second equation, we can find tan theta. Uh. And then in the first equation, dividing it by cos theta. Uh, okay. Yeah. I think your procedure is correct. Okay. Your procedure is correct. I th you can get it. You can get it like this also. Okay. Uh, from tan theta, uh, sine tan theta equal to OEA minus OEA by XP. Okay. Wow. Okay. So... But the easiest method is, uh, if you know, you can tell, but your method is also correct. Okay, your method is also correct. Uh, the, I, I feel the easiest method is, because here have x by a, here have x by a. y by b, y by b. Cos theta, sin theta. Sin theta, cos theta. Now you something should spark in your mind so squaring and adding squaring on both sides and yeah that's all that's all that's all okay very good so i think i don't know the name what is the name pragadish pragadish okay so one square plus two square 
So one square plus two square implies uh, how this is a plus b whole square formula. So x square by a square uh, cos square theta plus a square by b square. sin square theta plus 2xy divided by ab uh, cos theta into sin theta. So, and then plus x square by a square sin square theta plus y square by b square cos square theta minus 2xy by ab uh, sin theta into cos theta. Is equal to 1 square plus 0 square. So you can cancel these two. If you add these two, you'll get what? Uh, x square by a square plus if you add these two, you'll get y square by b square equal to 1. So is an envelope of equation 1. Okay, suppose if you use uh, from two equations, you can find tan theta. Actually, uh, y by b, y by b, cos theta equal to cos theta equal to x by a sin theta. So, uh, sin by cos that is the a y a y divided by bx equal to sine by cos which is tan theta okay so in the right angle triangle so this is a 90 degree this is theta so this this is ay this is bx this is ay this is bx Okay, uh, and then you need to find sine theta from this. So if this is actually, you need to find this side. Okay, so root of what? A x a y square. Sorry, root of a square y square plus b square x square. Root of a square y square plus b square x square, and then you need to find sine theta. Sine theta equal to a y by this term, and the cos theta equal to b x by this term, and then you need to substitute and you need to eliminate. So you will get the final answer is same. Are you got the final answer same or not? Anybody told this, this idea? Somebody told this idea? Yes, sir, so not the same idea. answer. Same answer, but a little bit lengthier, yeah, little bit lengthy, that's all. But you'll get the same answer. Is it correct? OK. So you should know at least two methods okay, for each problem. So you should, uh, you sh you should always try some other method. Suppose if I solve one problem in one method, you will try and solve the same problem in some other method. So then only you can increase your uh, confidence level. So, okay, the confidence level. You can think, okay, any problem, if any problems will come, I will do it in the examination. So your mindset will, you have very good, strong mindset, 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 okay. So 
should practice more problem and also you should practice the in different manner okay don't uh, uh, you should don't practice the same method which i solved in the classroom problem number four find the envelope of the family of uh, find the envelope uh, please write the question find the envelope of the family of curves uh, x cos alpha plus y sin alpha equal to a second alpha solution so here we have secant alpha so that's why i'm going to divide divide by cos alpha if i divide by cos alpha uh, secant square alpha you'll get it if, if you have secant square alpha you can write one plus tan square alpha so then you can then you can write try to convert in the form of quadratic in tan square alpha so that is the idea so, but you can try in your own method. If you have some other idea, you can try. No problem. So now, this is equation one. Divide. Divide one by cos alpha. So if you divide by cos alpha, you'll get x plus y sin alpha by cos alpha is tan alpha equal to a secant alpha divided by cos alpha okay so x plus y tan alpha y tan alpha equal to a into secant square alpha, secant square alpha you can write 1 plus tan square alpha. So you can write this is uh, x plus y tan alpha minus, uh, minus a into 1 plus tan square alpha equal to zero. First I will write minus a 10 square alpha. Minus a tan square alpha plus y tan alpha plus x minus a plus x minus a equal to zero. So this is a quadratic in tan alpha. Quadratic equation in uh, tan alpha. Okay, now so the envelope is b square minus 4ac is equal to 0. So b is y, so y square minus 4a is uh, minus a c is uh, x minus a equal to 0. So you'll get y square plus 4a into x minus a equal to 0. OK. So now uh, this is the envelope of Did anybody uh, use some other method? If you use some other method, you can just tell the idea. Maybe you can differentiate. So that is the second method. Otherwise, if you use any other method than this, you can tell how you solve the, the same problem in a different manner. OK.
So fifth problem. Find the uh, envelope of the family of curves x cos alpha, sorry, x secant theta, x secant theta minus y tan theta equal to a where theta is a parameter. So now I'm going to differentiate this equation with respect to theta. So differentiate one partially with respect to theta. We have x into, if we differentiate secant theta, we'll have secant theta into tan theta. minus y into differentiate tan theta will get secant square theta equal to 0 or you can write x into 1 by cos theta into sin theta divided by cos theta minus y divided by cos square or equal to equal to y secant square theta, you can write y by cos square theta. So cos square theta, cos square theta gets cancelled. So x into sin theta equal to y. So sin theta equal to y by x. So in the right angle triangle, This is 90 degree, this is theta, so sin theta equal to y by x means this side is y, here x, so this side is root of x square minus y square. Okay, now I need uh, I need to eliminate theta, so secant theta is a reciprocal of cos theta, so cos theta is from this you have uh, root of x square minus y square divided by x. This is cos theta and also I need tan theta. Tan theta equal to y by root of x square minus y square. So now substitute in the equation 1. So 1 implies x into secant theta. Secant theta you can write uh, 1 by cos. Okay, that is a reciprocal of this. Reciprocal of this. So x by, this is a multiplication symbol. x by x by root of x square minus y square and then minus y into tan theta. Tan theta is y by root of x square minus y square equal to a. So we take LCM root of x square minus y square. So in the numerator we have x square minus y square equal to k or root of x square minus y square equal to a. This implies we have x square minus y square equal to x square. Okay. So 
Anybody solve this problem with different method? Sir, in the differential equation, we can divide by divide the equation by secant theta, sir. Ah, uh, secant and theta. Squaring wow. differential equation, sir. And squaring yes, sir. the equation one and two and one minus two, we get the answer, sir. Ah, uh, please, please. Ah, uh, uh, sorry. Ah, uh, I think you have what is same. Ah, uh, this equation is same. Ah. Uh? Yes, sir. X secant theta minus y tan theta equal to a. Okay, I understand. And then uh, you are, you need to differentiate partially with respect to theta, wa? or you are dividing directly by secant theta, wa? Yeah. Sir, in the differential equation, divide by secant theta, sir. Differential and then equation. The equation Where is the differential equation? Sir, in second equation, sir, divide by secant theta. This yeah, equation, na? This equation, uh -huh. na? Yes, sir. Oh, I call this is second equation. Okay. So if you divide by secant theta, you have what? X tan theta minus y secant theta equal to zero. Yes, sir. Okay. Then we square, square the first equation and second equation and one minus two, we get the answer, sir. Okay. One minus two. Okay. The equation one minus two. The equation one minus two. Okay. That is good. So if you got the some something different uh, uh, method, than this so write in, write neatly in your notebook in your free time and post in the group maybe your classmates also they will read and understand that method also okay what is your name sir ajit kumar ajit kumar okay thank you Okay, so still I have five more minutes. So I solve one more problem. Uh, sixth problem. Uh, find the envelope of the family of parabolas. Find the envelope of the family of parabolas. Uh, y equal to x tan alpha, x tan alpha minus uh, g x square, g x square by two u square. Into, into secant square alpha. Okay, so where alpha is a parameter. Where alpha is a parameter. Okay, so now uh, this is a 2u square. Uh, this is 2q square. Here I have tan, here I have secant square alpha. So now I am going to try to convert this is one plus tan square alpha. I'll try to write in terms of uh, quadratic in tan alpha. Okay, I'll try first. Y equal to uh, x tan alpha minus g x square by 2 u square into 1 plus tan square alpha. Okay, uh, so let's take tan alpha is equal to some t. Tan alpha equal to some t for notation. So that's why I'm taking this some t. Uh, so y equal to xt minus minus uh, gx square 
minus g x square by 2 u square and to 1 plus t square. 1 plus t square. Okay. So now, uh, just to rewrite this equation, just I'm going to multiply. Okay, as to rewrite uh, g x square by 2 u square into 1 plus t square. I'll write everything the left hand side minus 60 uh, minus 60 minus 60 plus y equal to 0. Now throw out multiply by 2 u square. So to multiply by 2 is square, we have g x square to 1 plus t square minus 2 u square into x t plus 2 u square into y equal to 0. Okay, now multiply, you get g square x square, g, g x square and the g uh, x square t square minus 2 u square x t plus 2 u square y equal to 0. So first I'm going to write t square term g x square t square and then t term minus 2 u square x t and then the constant term g x square plus 2 u square y equal to 0. So here the quadratic in t is quadratic in t. So here t is a parameter. So initially alpha is a parameter but t is what tan alpha. If alpha is a parameter tan alpha is also a parameter. So quadratic in T where T is a parameter. So for this, you know that the envelope is B square minus 4 is e equal to 0. So envelope is B square. B is minus 2 u square x all square B square minus 4 a. A is g x square uh, c c is uh, g x square plus 2 u square y equal to 0 now this is 4 u power 4 x square minus 4 g x square into g x square plus 2 u square y equal to 0. So you can divide throughout by 4 and you can throw out divide by x square also because uh, x is not equal to 0. If x is 0, so y equal to 0, so there is nothing. So, so remaining you have uh, u square u square minus g x square minus 2g u square y equal to 0. So I'll rewrite here u power 4 minus g square x square minus 2g minus 2g u square y. You can stop here. You can stop here. Okay. If you want to simplify further, you can simplify like this x square g square x square uh, plus throughout multiply by minus sign. I have this so 2g q square y minus u power 4 equal to 0. So g square x square equal to u power 4 minus 2g u square y 
or x square equal to 1 by g square q power 4 minus uh, 2 q, q square g y or okay so x square equal to i am taking minus 2 q square by g commonly uh, remaining half minus 2 u square by g so i have y I multiply these two uh, minus two u square okay, g okay y minus uh, u square by two g. If you multiply these two, two two gets cancelled minus into minus plus so g square uh, u power four by g square okay so this is the envelope of the uh, equation one. I think uh, I think you saw this equation where you saw this equation parabolas ah, parabola okay actually I, uh, actually we are finding the envelope of the fam families of parabolas okay so this, this is the family of parabolas okay uh, the the answer is the envelope okay this is actually studied in the uh, a trajectory of the projectile two dimensional project two dimensional project equation yeah equation of project okay correct is Envelope of envelope of equation one. So now I am going to give some practice problem and then we can leave uh, the session. So first problem. So find the envelope of the family of parabolas x cos theta. plus y sin theta equal to p where theta is a parameter second problem x by a second theta minus y by b tan theta uh, equal to 1 where uh, theta is a parameter so the first problem the answer is uh, I'll give one more problem uh, first problem the answer is uh, x square plus y square equal to p square the answer for the second problem is uh, equation of the hyperbola equation of the hyperbola x square my x square by a square minus y square by b square equal to one mm, okay uh, even you can check it here uh, what is the hyperbola uh, parametric form A yes, secant theta, b tan theta. Ah, a yes, secant theta and b tan theta. If you substitute here, x is equal to a secant theta, a, a gets cancelled, secant square theta. Here, b, b gets tan, gets cancelled, tan square theta. Secant square theta minus tan square theta equal to 1. So, so from this also, you can, uh, you can predict the answer is the uh, hyperbola. Okay, similarly, you can check the answer here. I think if you know the parametric form, you can check the, you can predict the answer. Similarly here, I think for third problem, uh, the final answer is the ellipse. For x is equal to a cos theta and y equal to b sin theta. So a, a gets cancelled. So cos square theta, here b, b gets cancelled, sin square theta. So cos square theta plus sin square theta equal to 1. So you got the equation of the ellipse.
okay now last problem third problem okay uh, find the envelope of the find the envelope of the lines find the envelope of the lines x cosecant theta x cosecant theta minus uh, y cot theta equal to a equal to a where theta is a parameter okay so try these three problems if you got the answer uh, you can post in the group but i will i'll tell the answer for the third problem also So the answer is uh, x square minus y square equal to a square. Please check it. x square. Okay. Okay, thank you. Uh, we'll meet again on again Friday. Friday, first hour. Okay, thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank, thank you, sir. 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 Thank you, Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you.